Hello and welcome to this video showing you an experiment that will explain how convection works. So I have a uh, just a glass uh, square tube here which I filled with water and into this I'm going to put some potassium permanganate crystals. These don't actually do anything, they're just purple and a pretty colour. Let's throw that away. So I'm just going to dump a load of these crystals in the top here so that it becomes a nice strong purple colour so that you can all see what's going on. Now when it's not being heated not a lot is going on. The potassium permanganate purple colour is staying at the top. I'm going to start by heating this side and then we're going to see what happens and then I'm going to heat this side. So I've got my Bunsen burner safety flame, I'm just going to turn it so it's ever so slightly blue because I don't want this too hot and I'm just going to heat this corner down here. So as water particles are being heated, they gain more energy. As they gain more energy, they start moving around more. As they start moving around more, bumping into other things, they get more gaps in between each water molecule. As they get more gaps in between each water molecule, they become less dense and the less dense things rise up above the more dense things. Now you can see that the purple colour has started to move down this side. This is because as the water is getting less dense and it's moving up, it's causing a convection current as it's moving around this way. So I'm now just going to heat the other side so I can show you what happens. So just watch this nice bit of purple colour here. And I'll heat it, heat it up. Again, as the water particles get more energy, they're going to get heated up more. More energy, more moving around. The more they move around, bump into things, they get gaps between the molecules. They become less dense and they start to rise up. And hopefully you can see that the purple colour is now moving back around this way. After um, the water has become less dense, purple colour is now coming down this side, it is going to be replaced by cooler, more dense water. The water that has risen up is going to cool down itself, going to become more dense. The water at the bottom is going to become less dense, so that is going to move up. The water at the top is then going to move down, and this is a convection current.